What is up guys, Solvash here with another video and I'm very sorry for the delay. I've been really busy this past week, uh, update coming. Uh, right now, what I'm actually going to do is I'm very close to level 55, so I'm just going to do some auto loots and get this experience. That way I can finish this level 55, I get to surge some more armor. I will get to level some pets up again and that also unlocks Atlantis the third stage or map featured where you can run around and it is an underwater map and let's see how many of these it's gonna take I'm getting 3240 experience per time and there we go leveled up 55 finally and let's see we're going to get into backpack um let's start with the boots i've been wanting to see some of my armor so gonna go ahead and surge this up i have quite a few i realized after the video i did last week that i was going to need to come back and redo some of my surges so let's do it uh do we have super ice no um, all right, get the might up some more, and man, I should have leveled that up. I'll try and go back and catch that. No damage. What I'm really wanting is either a super, which is a blue, or an epic, which is purple. I'd love to get all purples and mega ice. Uh, no, I've already got it. Okay, I'm going to replace that then. All right. Um, let's see here. Can we get one more? We need either another blue or another purple. Super damage. Uh, I can't add it. No, I can't. I already have the purple. All right. Let's try again. No. Nope. 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 Ah. Super health. Uh, sure. We'll take it. Health is always good. Goes with my build. And let's upgrade this stuff. Try to get them all at least to level 5. Way I can get that acumen spread out. Helps out quite a bit. Let's see. I'm going to move on to the chest piece. Uh, we've got three blues already. Let's see what else. We Wait a minute. Uh, shouldn't have done that. I think I just pulled a Josh. All right. <laughs> Mega Thunder. Awesome. Purple right out of the gate on my chest. Wait. Yeah. Consume that because I'm not wanting actual thunder, but the extra acumen from those help out. And yes, I'm going to replace that one right there because I can't have two of them and let's try for slot four super armor and we'll take it and moving on to the next one first <laughs> surgeon But don't watch it, I will forget to do that. I may have to go back and check some of this stuff. There we go. Now moving. Uh, helmet. Two purples here already, so let's see what we can get. We're down to almost 100 surge seals left. We've got three to four pieces of armor left to go. Maybe we can get these done. Super health, already have it. I'm gonna have to refine it. Okay, all these greens, all these greens. I've still yet to see an orange in this. I have heard they do have them. I don't know if they've released them yet though. Health, no. Mana regen, no. Armor, no. Health, no. Armor, no. Come on, that's some very, very bad luck. Mega damage. I've already got it. Ah, oh. well, I guess that'll be another 500 acumen. Uh, super armor. I've already got it. 
and it's already a purple. Oh, I'm having bad luck on this one, guys. Down to 78. Come on. Mega Mana. Yes. All right. Three purples and a blue hell. That's not bad. All right. Neptune's Chain. Ooh, I don't like that at all. We still have a green here. Got to do something about that. Um, green, nope, green, nope, green, nope, nope. Ah. Uh. I'm having terrible luck. This is not going in my way. Thunder, no. A little bit of lag there. Yeah, see there? Okay, we used quite a bit on this one piece. Hopefully we can get something soon so I can get to these last ones or I'm going to run out. Super health. Oh, no, I've already got the purple one. Super net damage. Um, sure. And since I've already got very few left and these two last pieces let's just go ahead and try to get something at least decent on these two before I do run out of surge seals super ice I've already got it and I have to um, come on nope super mana region sure why not get mana back cool really fast helps out a lot Go ahead and upgrade this to at least level 5 to begin with. And let me go back and check this one. I don't think I leveled any of that up. No, I didn't. There we go. Get that up to 5. Oh, damage reduction. Let's go ahead and take that one up to. And last piece. Be the ring. No? Wait. I knew I didn't top those up. That's why I go back and check them. <laughs> Always go back and check them. Double check everything. Never know what you're going to lose out on. And 37 left. All blues there. Rings. Already got two purples. Let's try and load this one up. I've got 34 left. Let's go for all purples. Can we do it? With the luck I've had with had so far probably not blue mana region I've already got that it was in a purple to consume it or refine it into acumen thunder super armor oh well I kind of use that anyway I've got the purple mega damage uh, okay sure let's replace it and go ahead and upgrade that right quick and one more to go. 16 left. Can we get something decent? Anything. 13 left. No, no, no. Super damage. Ah, oh, I've already got super, the epic damage. Come on. 8 left. 6. Super armor. Oh, I've already got the purple one. Ah. One more. Come on. 4 left. No armor, no one left. Come on, this has got to be it. Got to be it. Mana, <laughs> that's terrible. Okay, well, 10 chances left with diamonds. Ah, uh, let's go ahead and try it. Super armor, I can't do that. I've already got the purple one. Ah, ice, eight left. Come on, all right. Diamond prices are going up. Finally, mega ice, oh, mega net damage. And that is a very nice ring now. All purple net damage, mana restore. And let's see what we can get into. I'm going to go over here to Valar Island. And this is where we're going to access the new world map which is going to be Atlantis and this is my first look oh 
cool or underwater. And that is as guardian right there, the guild leader of consortium, top guild on the Canadian server Chaos. Let's take a look around here, see what's actually on this map before we get started on doing some instances. Now, hmm, let's go ahead and go find it. Let's see where it takes us to. Very unique layout, a lot different than some of the other ones. And let's take a look. Recommended might 124. I believe I'm a little bit over 150, so this shouldn't be too too complicated. Uh, pet setup I'm running: Boxer, Captain Sam, Dingus, and Boric. And a little trick here to show you how to do some PVE: uh, get these guys up here. Mm. Got to get them grouped together didn't quite work out. We'll try it again though. And as far as the update goes, guys, um, it's been quite an interesting week. I have upgraded. That's why it's taken me so long to get this out. Uh, it should help me do things a lot quicker and uh, get content out a lot faster for you guys. Um, I'm gonna, there we go. I'm sorry. <laughs> But on top of that, we are currently in our seventh state this week. We are traveling up the East Coast. We are in West Virginia right now. So I may be possibly coming through a state that you live in or are close to. If you are, leave me a comment and you might possibly get to see me pass by or pass through. Um, now here, I'm just gonna utilize parry break and it seems to work fairly well on some bosses that don't do anything really special or that are very complicated which this guy eh, got him in and what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna switch the Bork and I'm just gonna go to town because that damage is gonna be increased because his parry break is gone and we're just try to finish him off here before I lose transformation should be no problem at all and it's not too bad for a first level. A lot of cool new things. Uh, I like seeing new mobs. Uh, two star, 3300 experience for one, card flip, and we get a blue. Not bad. All right, um, shall we go for another map? Oh, we have deep sea. Oh, nice, free stuff. Always great. Yeah, let's uh, map. Let's go to the next one. See how far we can get. Probably one or two more, maybe. Um, here we go. Now, best thing to do, draw them all in and just try to take them all down at one time. The faster you group them together, the quicker they can go down, especially the range stuff. So I'm going to take that stuff out first. Uh, the particular setup, uh, Captain Sam is back out into an event now, finally again. Uh, so I'm maybe picking up some more soul shards for him. And we do have another pet that we're going to be doing too, which is Mephisto. Uh, they had the event for him, and that will be coming up very soon as well. Uh, oh, we're getting lucky. This is the second map with the question mark in it. And is that going to be close to the boss? I hope so. Mm. Now, let's see. I'm gonna save that for the boss, and hopefully, it will be in this one or right in the next section of it. And what are the odds are we getting boost speed? That's actually fairly nice, especially in some of these maps if you're trying to do a three star on them. But right now, we're just trying to make it through them. And Captain Sam helping out with juggling them there. And hopefully, there we go. Yeah, we're at the boss finally. We have another underwater creature, the Aqua Assassin. And silence him. 
get rid of some of this other stuff. And let's see how Captain Sam fares on his ferry break. I don't think he's going to fare too well with it. And there we go back on him. Yeah, he's dropping quick. Now, yes, Captain Sam does attack very slow. I will agree with you there. I've heard and seen quite a few comments about that. Slow man Captain Sam, as somebody had said, I believe. But you know what? That parry break right there, it helps out a lot. That's two parry breaks on that boss and one transformation. So if you know how to utilize it and you can stay ranged with the boss and that slam right there just finished them off, it just makes things that much easier. <clears throat> Hopefully we will be working up with a new setup here soon and we'll show you some more tips and tricks on some PvE and some PvP. Some that actually came from uh, the guild leader which is right there as Guardian. Um, spoke with him about some stuff that we found and uh, we'll have a tips and trick video on some stuff that you probably don't know about yet. And well, how you doing man? Let's take a look at his gear real quick. Oh, he didn't go Neptunes, he went Hades. And it's pretty nice. Level 63. Look at all the epics, man. Very unique setup for the pets. I'm going to have to speak with him soon about that setup, see what we can find. Um, I believe I had a comment about that today, as a matter of fact, or it could have been yesterday. Actually, it was in this past week sometime because I've not been able to check too much stuff now that so we stop I'm here and able to do it now well let's let's finish this third one here and see how far we can get now perfect setup in a circle draw them all in and do that move and Captain Sam right behind me keep them juggled keep them from hitting you and main thing keep those pets alive they help out quite a bit if you don't realize how much damage they can actually do now with the health attributes from the surge pills, I'm sorry, the awakening pills on the pets, I've been able to utilize them a lot more because of almost doubling their health on every pet I have. I always try to go for that health on them. So it, it helps out quite a bit when you get up in the higher levels. And of course, once you get up in the higher levels, you're going to unlock more and more stuff to increase their stats. And finish these up. The freeze it helps out so much. Let's see, Boxer is taking quite a bit of damage so far. And we're gonna pick this gold up after talking talking to Asgardian. Found out that yes, <laughs> once you get up there, uh, I believe it's 2,000 refinement stones and roughly 5 million gold per piece to go to what was it fort not fortification uh, refinement level eight and yeah that's that's a big chunk I'm pretty sure he finished those up this past week as I believe I saw in guild chat and um, we'll actually go over that with him of course once we get to sit down and talk with him I'll finish these couple up here and What do we have for... Hey, we've got another question mark. We have a storm summoner. It's... Hmm, some type of... Looks like a underground... Not underground, underwater... Werewolf, maybe? Ah, uh, we're just gonna juggle some stuff around with Captain Sam. He's got a lot of extra stuff popped out. And, yeah, look at that damage. 200,000 in one hit from that and it hits multiple things it's pretty sick and get some of this period breakdown on him can I get it can I yes all right take him out let's drop everything we have notice the increased damage some of them I'm I'm just guessing the crit chance increases I, it's just a guess for me but oh pretty sure I probably should have avoided that took a lot of damage from pets and Bork needs to be back nope he died okay dingus you're left 
and the only reason Dingus is left because he has over 80,000 hit points. And finish him up here. That's a pretty cool boss. Unique skill. And we finished. How many stars? One star. Hey, a star is a star. I'll take it. It's a win. Card flip. Green. Boo. And guys, that is it for this video. Any questions, comments, please leave them. Uh, as always, like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, keep updated on that. Follow me on my Twitter. Uh, stay tuned, guys. Uh, hope everyone has a great day.